but it is the same print. No, I would not be wearing this together. I just didn't take off the top because I want you guys to see, do not buy this as a set. Hey guys, welcome back to my channel, it's Champ Bailey. Today I will be doing a Zara try on haul. Yes, I purchased all these items myself. I actually went into the store and got them this time. I did not order them online. I just find a lot of inconsistency with Zara sizing. So um, I prefer to just go into the store because there's one you know, close by me, probably about um, 20, 30 minutes. So I decided to go in the store and I went to do a little shopping that day. So I actually got to try it on, feel it, touch it in the store. Some of the items I tried on, some of them I didn't. The ones that I didn't try on, I tried on for you guys today. Let's see how it goes. Get our fingers crossed. But other than that, there's no particular theme to this try on. It's just a lot of things that I went in the store and touched and liked. Unfortunately, the store doesn't have as many things as online does, which gets in my nerves, but it's okay. I would rather touch it and feel it and know that I like it in the store before I buy it and have to send it back. Although Zara has really good shipping time, like meantime I order, I get my, my things within like two to three days, really, really fast. And when I send it back, they get it. I get my money back in my card immediately or I'll take it back in the store. So the things you order online, you can take back in the store, which I really, really love. So anyway, without any further ado, let's get started with this try on haul. Okay, first item I will be reviewing is this red collared mini dress. Super cute. I'm going to stand up so you guys can see how long it is. So this dress is cotton. It's very stretchy. This is a size small. It's $25.90. Um, I didn't try this on, of course, because I knew this would fit, um, because it has so much stretch in it. Now, um, I don't know where I'll be wearing this to. I just, I just be buying stuff. I don't know where I'm going to wear this to, but I thought it was really cute and it was a really good price. I know that Zara is going up on their prices a little bit, but, but quality is good. Like, their quality is amazing, so I, I kind of, I'm okay with that. Um, this dress super cute for fall and it can be summer that's why i like buying things that are fall and summer i can wear them year round especially because i live in california so you know but um this dress is super cute and i love it and i love the color and it's probably gonna look really cute with like some boots and a jacket for winter so yeah 25.90 so when i like something i get it in every color that i can this dress actually comes in multiple colors, but I only found them in the Zara that I was at in the small in these two colors. Um, I think this is either a gray or a blue. I don't know what it's giving off on camera, and I don't even know what it's giving off in real life, but I like the color. So, um, I think this dress also comes in brown. Um, I'm sure online they have it in every color available. 360 turn. It's super cute. I will be keeping this dress. Um, I don't wear dresses often, but I would actually pair this with some boots as well and maybe a jean jacket. Um, if you live anywhere, oh, let me back up a little bit. If you were, live anywhere that is not too cold like I do in the winter time, um, yeah, it's really cute. Um, I highly recommend this dress, $25.90, and it's a really good price cotton material and I say you could size that on this because it is very stretchy. Let's get a close up. Okay, so this piece I was really excited about. I actually seen a girl trying this on at the store and I stopped her and asked her, like she's in the fitting room and I walked in, I was like, where'd you get that dress from? And she came out the fitting room to show me. It was in the front of the store and uh, I was like, oh my, it looks so good on her. It actually looked better on her than it does on me right now. I'm a little disappointed. Um, I don't really like these quarter sleeves. I wish they were either short sleeve or long sleeve. I don't like quarter sleeves. Um, but it's like a uh, a pleather. It looks it looks really leather. It looks really good quality, actually. It doesn't give pleather vibes, not to me anyway. Um, yeah, it looks better on her than it does on me. This dress is forty nine ninety, so fifty dollars. Um, I think it's really super cute. Um, but I just like the way it looked on this on the girl better. Like, I don't know why. So 
so I suggest that if you're like into this style, if you have somewhere to go, um, dinner, date, anywhere, because it's not super revealing, but it's still sexy. Not revealing, but then in the back, boom, sexy, you know? So first date, dinners, girl night, like I think it's a really cute dress. These sleeves are bothering me though. That's it, that's, I'm not liking that. But other than that, if you're a quarter sleeve girl and you're very curvy, cause it's, this is very stretchy, it will look really good on you. I'm not as curvy as the girl who's trying it on. It was like, she was busting out of it. Like she looked really good. So I think that if you like it, you should go ahead and try it. Cause things look different on different people's body types. So I say give it a whirl, it's super cute. And it's really nice quality. Okay, this next outfit I probably will not be wearing together. <laughs> but it looks really cute together. It's top. Um, I'm not sure how much it is. It's in the tag behind me and I can't see. So I will list it below for sure. But this is super cute, but I know it is a size medium. Um, I love the way it looks. It's super cute. Um, I don't know what I'm wearing this to, like I always say, but this very um, kind of, I wouldn't say business because it's revealing right here, but it's it's out. It's like drinks, dinner, stuff like that. I love it though. Very happy with this purchase. Um, these pants as well. I also got these pants um, in a large. I got them in a large and a medium. And the medium fit really good. They're $35. And I really like the way they fit. They fit really, really good. Makes my butt really good, look good. It um, let me back up. It sucks in my stomach because it has this band at the top, which um, is is slightly dated. The band at the top, but it does look really good. And if you have a little area up here you're trying to hide, it does a really good job. Fits the body really good. And they're only thirty five dollars. Thirty five dollars can't beat that. So this one, oh, maybe I can see. Let me see in the camera how much this is. $35 as well, okay. So basically this is a $70 outfit. It looks really good. If you pair it with some really cute shoes. I like. Let me know what you guys think. Okay, this next outfit is different. Same top, I just kept it on for these purposes. So yes, this is the same print, but they're two different colors. I don't know if you can see that they're two different colors. This is more of a, a eggshell and this is more of a beige, but it is the same print. No, I would not be wearing this together. I just didn't take off the top because I want you guys to see, do not buy this as a scent. Do not. So um, these pants, I like them. I like the way they fit. They have a lot of stretch in them. I think these are a, let me see. Um, they're medium. They are medium. I'm glad they're medium. Um, and I didn't get the small. Only thing that I don't like is they're a little short. So I probably won't be keeping them that keeping them for that reason. Oh, it's like a hole in it. Oh. But um, I won't be keeping them for that reason because they're a little short. I do like that they're high waist. Um, this right here is giving me just a little, this little circle thing right here. Can y'all see that? I don't like it. It's giving me a little Ross, just a little bit. But other than that, I think I like the fit. They're just too short for me. I'm 5'6". If I was like 5'3", I'd probably keep them, but they're too short for me. But no, again, this is not an outfit. I just want to show you the pants with this top. So you guys do not buy this together if you see it online. But anyway. Okay, next outfit that I won't be wearing together either because this shirt is white. And the print in this is eggshell. Doesn't look right. But I just want to show you this shirt. Yes, it's a plain $17 white shirt from Zara. But I do like Zara shirts because women tend to have like the issue when we buy cheap stuff that it starts to look bally or low quality. And it starts to look dingy after like one wear. 
So yeah, $17 is not expensive, but just to wear something one time, it is very expensive. So I do like Zara shirts. This is one of their shirts. They come in black and other colors too. Get them online for a decent quality shirt for, you know, $17. That you can wear a few times and make sure you don't wash with any colors. That's how you keep your clothes crisp and white. Just a tip. And then these pants that I really like, I like them better than the other ones. Um, they just feel better to me on my body. What I don't like, again, I like the way they make my shape look too. But what I don't like is that these, these are also kind of short. Um, these are probably made for girls of like 5'3", 5'2", 5'3". I'm 5'5", 5'6", one of those, I'm not sure. But um, they're just a little too short for me. I want a little bit of a um, little slack at the bottom, like just, you know. And they kind of flare out just, just the tad. I can't really show you, let me see. Just a tad bit. I don't, I don't like that. I want it to really be tight and cuff my ankle and you know, give me some slack. Like, I don't like that they're so short, but I do like the way they fit. So will I be keeping them? Probably not because I have a lot of clothes and I don't need any more clothes that don't fit 100% right. I'm sorry, like clothes come too fast and too cheap for me to buy something. I'm starting to realize that and keep something that just doesn't fit for me or work for me 100%. But if you are a um, shorter girl, 5'2", five, 5'3", five, or shorter, I would highly recommend that you get these pants. Okay, same outfit. I just added this sweater onto it so I can show you guys what it looks like. Oh, do I have it on right? I think so. This sweater is... $45. I think this is the front. Hold on. Let me make sure this is the front. Okay. Yeah, I think this is the front because the tag is in the back. Okay, so this sweater is $45. Um, it's super cute. This is a size medium. I wanted a little bit oversized, so um, I got it in a medium. It's super cute. It doesn't really keep you warm at all because it's open, of course, in the front and the back. Um, it's, it's tight. It's kind of really tight around. My neck too is kind of choking me just a little bit, but that's okay. Um, I think this sweater is more like an accessory. It's not really doing anything, but I think it's super cute and it would look cute with jeans. You do need like a top, maybe like a camisole, which kind of defeats the purpose of why you have a sweater on with a camisole, but, or some type of shirt. I don't know. You'll figure it out. Um, or I'll figure it out. Maybe I'll come back. Check my Instagram out, I should say linked below and see how I style this. I'm not 100% sure yet what I'm going to do, but definitely probably like some boots. Um, I would definitely wear this with like jeans and a top though. I've seen people wear it with dresses. Mm, that's cute too, but it's, it's a sweater. So it, it's kind of odd, but it's definitely a accessory. Um, that's pretty much it. It's a statement piece. $45. I think it's really cute and I think it's worth it. And actually, I am, I'm kind of warm. I'm kind of warm up here. Not down here, but I'm kind of warm. So it is kind of doing its job. But anyway, I would highly suggest this sweater. I think it's really cute and I'm probably gonna keep it. Okay, this is a shirt. It's super cute. I have it all these same pants. No, I would not be wearing this together. Um, but this top is only $17. Um, it's super cute and it's very similar to this dress. It's just the shirt version and also, this dress comes in brown too so imagine this top in a dress and you have this so look on the website um they have this in this brown shirt in the dress form i didn't get it at the store because they didn't have it in a small they only had an extra small and a medium and the small fit really good on me so i was like uh, no i won't be getting it but i got the brown top instead it's super cute Good quality, only $17. And I love brown, especially for a fall color. So I will be keeping this. And I got it in a medium, if I didn't mention that already. I'm glad I got it in a medium instead of a, a small because as you can see, it's kind of it's kind of small. So, yeah. See, that's why I like going into Zara because I eyeballed this stuff. I didn't even, I didn't even try any of this stuff on. I just eyeballed it and knew that it was going to fit me. Like, 
and every size is different. I got larges in some things, I got smalls in some things, and I got mediums in some things, and I just knew. But that's why I don't like online shopping like that. I do, but I don't. But anyway, I said get this top. It's super cute, and they have multiple colors. Get them all. For the grand finale, this set, oh my God, I'm in love with it. It is a satin green. It looks pajama-y just a little bit, but it's super cute. So I had to put on heels for this one just to show you guys like the full effect. So, um, slightly a flare bottom, as you can see. Super cute. I seen this hiding in the corner. I'm taking this off my fall. I seen this hiding in the corner and I had to have it. Um, unfortunately, I am wearing the biggest size that's our offers. This is the large. Um, it does not come in extra large. And I cannot fit the medium. So, and if this top would have came in an extra large, I would have got it because I wanted a little bit of a bigger look. But actually, was, the large is fine because I didn't want to look like a pajama set too much. Um, but yes, if you are any bigger than me, I'm like not even 150 pounds, like barely 150 pounds. Um, and I'm five, 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 six. And this is the biggest size that comes in. Like Zara really needs to work on like their sizing. Like it's ridiculous. When have I ever been a large in anything? Sorry, make it make sense. But anyway. Like I said, if you're probably um, any curvier than me, just don't even, don't even, if you see this online. Hopefully they still have this online, it's super cute. Highly recommend it, like, this is the style that I'm going for with the right hair, the right bag. This is really classy, even though it kind of does work, but anyway, I like it. Teach you something, I like it. But anyway, um, yeah, this is it. But anyway, this concludes my try on haul for Zara. Thank you guys for watching. Remember to like, share, subscribe. Feel free to give me feedback on the items that I got because I have time to take them back. So, um, yeah, thank you guys for watching. And um, I'll be back with more. Bye.